Uh, we're now going on to a, a practical one. So we're going to go on to uh, Luke, who's going to uh, go through some bits and pieces to do with uh, PE, warm-up activities, games, things that might not normally happen uh, in, in every school. And he's looking for some volunteers at certain points as well. <laughs> Otherwise, it's me. Um, yeah, thank you. Um, my name is Luke. Um, I'm just going to hand a few resources out. So we'll have a quick look um, while I'm speaking. Just have a quick look and pass them around. Um, so I just want to do a few a few quick demos of different ways of thinking on how we can um, how we can engage our children. Um, so if you, what you're looking through now is to, um, some resources. Um, so you've got different different games. Um, there's an equipment one going around as well. Um, I don't work for them, so. <laughs> um, so what I'm going to do now, if Roger, can I borrow you quickly? Yeah, of course. If you can just stand stand on that red line. Yeah. Um, what I'm what I'm going to do here, they're going to be very much cricket drills. Um, so what I'm going to say to you, I'm going to give you three coaching points. Okay. So the first one will be having your knees flexed. Yeah. Okay. Hands together. A bit lower, please. You're quite tall. Okay. <laughs> Hands together. Okay. And then when we catch, make sure that we give. Okay. So what, what do I mean by that? Come across to my ball. Okay. So we bring it in. Okay. We've done this before. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You want to pass it back? Okay, very simple, okay? What happens when we've got um, kids that can do that? Majority of kids can catch the ball um, from year four quite easily, I think. So if we can start bringing in equipment, um, this will be in the RAM catalogue that we've got going around. This is, um, it's called a catch it board, so it's a RAM. You could be right. Yeah. So basically what this does, I've been practicing. Can I show you the, the kids really enjoy this? It's amazing how good the kids yeah. are at actually doing this. Okay, so what we've got is, so all I'm going to do is underarm it, it's going to shoot off the ramp, and hopefully Roger can catch it. Can we start easy, please? Easy. <laughs> and watch the camera. Keep going back. <laughs> yeah, no, I want a little bit more time. Okay, okay make sure our feet are facing, both feet facing. Whoa. Okay. So that's one more. Okay, easy. Okay, Steve, can you stand up for me? So what happens now once we've got the kids doing that easily? Okay, they've mastered that. Steve, can you just stand here for me and wave that in front of them? Yep. Okay, now what we've done here is we've given Roger a big, big distraction. Steve. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the <laughs> Okay, so Steve, what we're doing is just waving it in front of him. Are you alright? You're going back to the wall. Oh, no, 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 just a bit close. Oh, keep your eyes open. Whoa. Okay. Okay, do we get the idea of that? That thing is distraction. And if it does come off the stump, really, you can sort of, you can sort of move, get there. Um, the kids will be standing a bit further back. Yeah, you should be in front. Yeah, I'm yeah. yeah, I was even <laughs> But um, that is £40 pound out of the catalogue. Um, I don't know where I put the catalogue. But it is a very good piece of equipment. Um, that's one of the drills. Um, but I think it's really uh, very good. It does engage the children because it is something different. And it's something um, it's harder than just, just catching. Okay, um, can I roll you two again? Yeah. Like this, no. Roger, can you stand here? Stand there. Steve, can you stand here facing Roger, please? Yep. Okay, what I'm going to do here is just test your reactions, okay? <laughs> come closer, come closer, Steve. Don't be shy, don't be shy. Yeah, yeah. Reactions aren't very good. Okay, I'm going to drop this ball here onto that red line. See, so yeah. you need to be lower here. Lower, lower, lower. I you can't get much there, right? You, but you're very tall, you two. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop it. It's going to bounce once. And the first person to catch it wins. Is it alright? Can I push Steve over? Ready? Oh, did it bounce? You right, Steve? Yeah, I'm just going to wait. Oh, no. Have one more, have one more. Oh. Okay, she's got it, she's got it. Same again, okay, reactions. Um, kids really do enjoy that. Something different. We've got loads of these as well, haven't we? Loads of them. Um, so that's. Two drills done. Um, as well, when we're playing, when we're playing cricket, 
If we've got a kid that can, a child that can hit the ball quite well, give them something different, okay? That's half the size of the bat. Um, so the edges have gone, it's just the middle. Um, that will make it more challenging for them to hit the ball because um, you haven't got much of a surface here. Um, as well, when we're catching, we've got these two. Um, so a bit of a wider bat if, if someone's struggling to hit the ball. And also, everybody loves tennis. If we're playing cricket, just get the kids, um, get the children to just hit it like that. That's going to go much further than a cricket bat and they're going to they're gonna enjoy it more, aren't they? Yeah. Um, I've got some resources, so if you can take them when you go, but then that's, that's it. Thank you.